on behalf of the Commission, I wish to congratulate Professor Kobia for her appointment as the Cabinet Secretary, Ministry of Public Service, Youth and Gender Affairs. As a Commission, we feel proud that one of us has been elevated to the High Office of Cabinet Secretary. We thank His Excellency the President for that recognition, for recognizing Professor Margaret Kobia and the Commission that we have been able to, as a Commission, give the Cabinet Secretary to serve in the Executive. The Commission has made tremendous progress, some of which are highlighted under uh, the achievements that I'm just <coughs> going to go through. They may not be exhaustive. The achievements during the last five years include the completion of a new office block in which this conference room is hosted, <coughs> the enactment of the new Public Service Commission Act 2017, development and implementation of an ERP system, development of draft policy regulations 2018 that will give effect to the implementation of the PSC Act once gazetted, the delinking of the commission from the civil service and improved terms of service including higher enumeration for the secretariat staff, a contributory pension scheme, mortgage and car loan scheme for the secretariat staff, increased budget allocation for the commission. When we came in, the budget was 883 million for the year 2013-14, and that went up to 1.4 billion shillings during the 2017-18 financial year. Effectively completed the transfer of HR resources or HRM resources and personnel records to the devolved units. Capacity building for county public service boards and development of a fully fledged system of appeals and discipline processes. Restructuring of the commission, including establishment of compliance and quality assurance directorate to oversight implementation of commission decisions, including values and principles as enshrined in Article 10 and 232 of the Constitution. I'm really happy to come back and uh, do this adding over, which I was looking forward to doing. Let me also appreciate working here. I think working here is one of the best things that have happened in my life. I enjoyed being at Public Service Commission in terms of I had the space. I had the full support of the staff here, the commissioners. At no time, I used to listen to other chairs of other commissions articulating some of the struggles they have in their own commission. But uh, I'm happy even as I leave, we never had the camps. We worked with each one of the commissioners very harmoniously and with their respect and with dignity. I think this is something I'm doing, even for the remaining of the time that he left, we continue working together so that all of us enjoy our jobs. Areas on operational efficiency and effectiveness. And this is very much written with um, how have we been moving forward? What have we put on the table as the most suitable result and what have we struggled with? So I think from the time uh, Ambassador, we decided we want to finalize the strategic plan that we found. Then we are on the right path because we sat, we came up with a strategic plan that gave us an organization structure. We hired where we thought we needed to build capacity. So what I'm trying to say, the concern of having another draft strategic plan is more urgent than ever. Why? Because what we found actually is what we completed. So it gave us kind of like a, a departure point, a head start, 
So I think we need to do that. The building we are sitting in to here today, CEO will tell us, the commission that was there, started it. So we just have to give a push. So it's like confirming that nowadays we don't have to invent a wheel. We just need to help turn it. So I think in this building we completed it because so in other ones I want to recognize all the commissioners the commissioners who are there before us because I believe we stand on the shoulders and as I am leaving I'm wondering those who will come what kind of shoulders will they be standing on? But I believe there are many things in this achievement that they can only turn the wheel so that public service commission becomes a power to reckon in the public service and of course in the whole of the nation.